it's Gav here from DancePlanet.tv. Thanks for joining me as always. In this video, I'm bringing my predictions and the schedule for day eight of the World Starts Championship in the Alley Pally on Thursday, December the 21st from 7 p.m. And what a session it is. It is the final four games of the first round. I can't wait, and I'm sure that you guys, if you're being honest, there's been some shocks, some great talking points, some averages, and a couple of players that have eliminated themselves from the Premier League of Darts 2018, mentioning no names, Wadey and Chisnell. I'm sorry, guys, but I think that you have eliminated yourselves. Um, another talking point for another day. So as always, I'm going to be going through my predictions. Please leave your comments below. Some of the um, comments that we've had on some of the videos, I had 70, 80, 90, even 100 plus comments. And I've been going backwards and forwards with the banner and it's been great fun. So I do apologise as always. Some just picked me up on my spelling, others have picked me up on my pronunciation for the names. So I do apologise, but these videos are just fun and I'm being myself and I hope you're enjoying them as much as I am making them. So let's go through the evening and my predictions. So we start off with this first game. That's against Christo Reyes against Tony Alcinas. Now, as you can see, in this particular game, I've gone for Christo to win it 3-1. The only reason for that is because I've seen him play on telly a number of times. Um, he hit some good averages. I think he hit a good one in the Worlds a couple of years ago, 100 plus average, he can play really well. And I've not seen Tony play much. So I have to go with what I know rather than just guessing. So for anyone to be in this tournament, they have to be fairly good. So I've given him a set, but I think that Christo will win this one. 3-1. We then go on to Kim Hybrex against James Richardson. Kim Hybrex needs a really, really good run in these worlds to get some ranking points and money to keep himself in the world's elite. I think he's got a good draw here against James Richardson, who has been on telly a number of times, but never really gone deep into the tournament. And I don't think he's going to have enough for Hybrex. And I think when the draw was done, Hybrex went, yeah, you know what, I'm going to take this one. And for that reason, I think that he's going to be too much for Richardson and he'll win 3-1. We then go on to Darren Webster against Devon Peterson. Great to see Devon Peterson back in this tournament. Another party guy, a bit like Peter Wright. I remember a couple of years ago when he came on doing all his dance and all this stuff. And he had his hoverboard with him. Just brilliant. Great for the game. Uh, a good. I don't know if it's a good or bad job. This one was really... Really difficult for me because I really like Deverson Peterson, but I also like Darren Webster is a local guy to me. And as you know by now, I also always support the local guys to do really well. Darren, Darren Webster is is very, very good player. He's like a Jack Russell. He's always nipping at the heels of whoever it is. He never gives up. He's had a great 18 months. Um, and I think that he's going to have too much for Devin Peterson. And I think he'll go through this one 3-1. We then go on to the final game of the first round, which is my favourite player, Peter Snake Bright Right against Diego Portella. Peter Snake Bright Right, we know that he's been ill, but hopefully it's over that now. And he's not going to be changing his darts too much throughout the tournament. How many times is he going to change his darts? Once, twice, three times? I don't know. Let's hope he don't mess about with his equipment too much. Get a set of darts and equipment that he's playing well with and have a really good run. Anybody that he'd have got in the first round, I'd have probably almost put him for a 3-0. So this is nothing against Diego on this one. Um, it's just that Peter Wright is a very, very solid player. And if he's performing and back to his best after his illness, I can't see this guy getting a set off him. So for that reason, and Snake, well, I hope you do amazing. I hope you win it. And I think you're going to win this one 3-0. So as you can see, guys, these are my predictions for um, day eight from the World Starts Championship from the Ali Pali. Again, it's on Thursday, December 21st from 7 p.m. I uh, hope you've enjoyed the video. Please leave your comments below as always. If you did like the video, please leave me a like and don't forget to subscribe. As always, check out danceplanet.tv. We've got some great videos being added on there as they hit YouTube. As always, guys, it's been a pleasure and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. And until then... Bye!